Hello YouTube, me Brickman 609 signing in today um, with a tutorial in GIMP. Um, today we're going to be making a, an image fire effect. Um, so first what you want to do is open up GIMP, which I already have. Go to File, New. Um, make the width 400 pixels and the height 400 pixels and make sure it is in pixels. Press OK. Okay, what you want to do um, is go to Bucket Fill Tool and make sure your background is black. Okay, then go to Paintbrush. Um, come over here to the foreground and background colors and switch them so that the background is white and the foreground is black. Um, and go to the bottom and just make a squiggly line. Doesn't matter how straight it is. Kind of like this um, with three lines like that. So as you can see, it's not straight. Um, you don't really want it to be straight. Then go to the smudge tool, okay, and start just um, by smudging um, crazy and all around. And then later, it doesn't have to be exact because remember this is fire and fire is um, crazy. So yeah, um, just keep making all of these like little lines all throughout the other lines much like I am doing if you want, you can come to the bottom here and go like that. Um, just try to remove, or like, do kind of as sloppy as you can. Just don't go down with it. Um, but do your best and don't hold it down like I just did because it will look crappy and sloppy. And um, You can add this to pictures, but... Um, cannot use it for video. Once you're done, just go in and just like click and make some bigger ones all across. Then what you want to do is go to colors, color balance, go to shadows, 100 for red, for green, go to 30. And for yellow, go to negative 30. Then for midtones, do the same thing. 100, 30, negative 30. And for highlights, you want to go to 100, and then negative 100. Press OK. And there you have your fire. Um, you can add more but yeah that's pretty much it um, thanks for watching today's tutorial um, and how to make a fire effect in GIMP um, and as you can see it does look like fire um, you can also add an image behind that but I don't want to get into too much detail so thanks for watching Brickman609 signing off bye guys